So hello everyone, this is Kumar Shivam and welcome back to my channel. So in this video, I will talk all about veterinary course. What is the eligibility criteria? What is the admission procedure? What are the jobs that are available for a veterinarian? How much salary do a veterinarian get? Is there any placement option is available for veterinarian or not? What are the research options? These are the most important thing that one should look before choosing any course. So if you are planning to enter in veterinary course or you are already in veterinary course, you should must watch this video till end because you will get all the information regarding the veterinary science. So first start from the course. What is the course for veterinary? So BBSC and AH is the course. It means Bachelor of Veterinary Science and Animal Husbandry in which you have to spend your five and a half year where four and a half year is your academics and one year is your internship. After that, talking about the eligibility, you should pass your 12th with physics, chemistry, and biology with at least 50% of marks. But yeah, there is a 5% of relaxation for the reserve category students. And the minimum age requirement to enter in the veterinary course is 17 years. After 17 years only, you can enter in this profession. So, what is the admission procedure? How you can take the admission in veterinary course? So, the main criteria to take admission in veterinary course is your need marks. If you have a score quite decent in your neat marks, you can take the admission either through your state quota seat or you can go in the VCI counseling that. But yeah, there are some states who used to conduct their own state entrance examination like RPVT in Rajasthan, OUET in Odisha and UP CATET in UP. So you can enter like that. But yeah, if you haven't scored quite decent marks in NEET or you can't be able to qualify in your state entrance examination, still there is your hope. Still you want to pursue veterinary, you can enter in the private colleges. Talking about the fee structure. But yeah, if you want to go for the private colleges, always look for the VCI affiliated colleges. Because because if you don't go to the VCI affiliated college, you won't be able to give the PG entrance examination. So you must have this point in mind before taking admission in any college. So now let's talk about the fees structure. Fees structure varies where you are going for the government quota seat or you are going from the private seats. But yeah, if you are going for private seat, as I have already mentioned, you should look for the VCI affiliated college. In government quota seat, you have to pay 20,000 to 1 lakh per year, depending upon the college that you get through the counseling. Uh, for private, you will have to pay 6 to 8 lakhs per year. Even some colleges charge you donation of 5 to 10 lakhs, but the donation is for one time only and you have to pay 6 to 8 lakhs per year for the duration of five and a half year. And now let's talk about the features, why you should pursue veterinary for any admission related query or if you want to join me or if you want that I do your counseling for the veterinary course, you can join from the link in, given in the description box. I have put the link in the description box, you can join from there. So let's talk about the features, why you should pursue veterinary science. So the first one is veterinary science is a professional course. You will always get a social status and prestige and have a designation of doctor. You will always have a doctor title with your name. So that really sounds good, isn't it? Uh, now let's talk about the job option. So first of all, most of the students that are graduated from the veterinary course, they've joined as a veterinary officer. Even some states have a veterinary surgeon and assistant veterinary surgeon. If you are planning to go in the army sector, even after pursuing veterinary, you can join army as a captain in RBC, remote veterinary corps, or you can join BSF and ITBP where you have to look upon the treatment where you have to look upon the breeding, management, feeding of all these animals like dogs, camels, horses and apart from that you can work in the quarantine units also. There are many quarantine units in the ports and airports where you can join as a veterinary officer and in zoo centers also you can work in cattle farms like Goshalas also you can work in health centers also you can work and in pharmaceutical companies also you can work. Now let's talk about the self-employment. What are the options that you will have under self-employment? So you can open your own pet clinic, you can work as a mobile vet practitioner or you can go in the entrepreneurship option. I will rather say this is the best option that one should look for because you are not getting a job. You are a job provider. You will provide jobs to other people also. You will be a source of income for the farmers also. So one should must look for the entrepreneurship option if they are going in the veterinary course. Uh, now let's talk about the private sector. What are the companies that are available and that used to provide the jobs for the veterinarians? So if I talk about the nutrition companies, there are certain companies whose net income is very high. 
they used to earn in crores their net income is in crores even i and you can't think how much they are earning so they appoint veterinary in a regular basis so godrej vetrox salimar kapila grovel these are the nutrition companies who used to appoint veterinarian they are also pharma companies because you know in veterinary one should prescribe the medicine for the treatment of the animals so there will be a pharmaceutical companies they are mrs also so in pharmaceutical companies the main companies i have cited there are so many companies but only main companies i have cited here so entas is there sipla mankind verbac these all companies who used to appoint veterinarian and they used to provide a very handsome salary i would like to say and in animal husbandry you can look for amul mother dairy in your state there will be various dairy companies even government has announced that in every cities in every district one should have one dairy farm also recently government has released fund to start many veterinarian ambulance so the job option will be very much even in recent time i have seen a post where the difference where the margin between the veterinarians that is required and the veterinarian our country has is quite high let's talk about the poultry companies venki and savuna uh literally i will say their net income is far beyond our imagination we can't even think how much income they used to get through this poultry business they are quite ahead of our imagination so definitely these companies are the most recruiting companies in our veterinary sectors so we veterinarian plan for these companies because they used to provide us a very handsome salary now what salary do a veterinarian get uh, the most important question uh, the, i will say uh, whenever any student want to pursue any course they first look for this thing that what is the salary uh we can get from that course so first if i talk about the government jobs if you as appointed if you are appointed as a veterinary officer or a veterinary surgeon what salary you are getting from the government job so it varies you are appointed as a grade a officer so it varies from 65000 to 90000 depending upon the state in which you belong to and apart from that the private companies they used to provide a salary of 45 initial salary of 45000 even our seniors got the initial salary of 45000 and if i talk about the self practice my senior has started one clinic and within a one year the clinic number has increased to 3 from the one clinic he has managed to open the three clinics so options are many you should focus and you should work on your skill you should work on your experience then there will be no bar for salary salary will be negotiable these private companies will appoint you and give you salary of 1.5 lakh per month at least even in the recent time i have seen most of the students and from the gb pant university got a salary of 1.5 lakh per month in godrej and in agrovet also they have got a very good salary uh, if you plan to become a professor if you go for the pg and psd after that you will become a professor assistant professor associate professor and then professor so your salary will be around 1.5 lakh per month so if one is planning to go and shift in the foreign and practice there as a veterinarian so salary will be very high there are so many registered veterinarians who are practicing in usa and canada and they are getting a salary of 1.5 crore per year more than that also they are getting but i have collected some of the data that they are getting a salary of 80 lakh some are getting a salary of 60 lakh so you should plan your career and i will definitely say if you are going in this profession you will never regret i have never regretted and definitely you will never regret that why i have chosen this course option you will definitely never regret after 5 and 1/2 year you will have definitely a good number of job option you will definitely have a job satisfaction so that thing matters the most salary is uh, the secondary thing your job satisfaction matters the most so here you will definitely give a job satisfaction because you will get to know you will get to treat those patients who will not tell you the their problems what problems they are going through so now let's talk about the research option so after doing your graduation you can look for your post graduation either in the veterinary science or animal science in veterinary science you will have the clinical subjects as well as non clinical subjects and in the animal science you will all you will have all the non clinical subjects so if you are going through the non clinical subjects ultimately you will end up with the research options right. so we should look for the breeding from where we can increase their productivity so the options are many even in the upcoming videos also i will discuss about the many job options that are is in this video so if you really like my work do subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon so to get more update about the veterinary course and the job options and even i used to post many videos related to the icr and neat courses also so stay tuned to this channel me kumar shubham shining off take care bye bye